Apple Valley Sun Devils football top sports highlights of 2017. First undefeated team in regular season play in school history. Here are highlights. Apple Valley quarterback Jeff Widener rushes for two touchdowns and throws three scoring passes to lead Apple Valley past Silverado 40-39. Jeff Widener's 40-yard touchdown pass to Donovan Ferguson with one minute to play gives Apple Valley the come from behind one-point victory over the Hawks in the 2017 season opener for both schools. Barrel Game 2017. The home team Granite Hills Cougars take the field. Heavy underdogs to Apple Valley. Kashan Griffin scores three touchdowns, this a 60-yard punt return, and Jeff Widener throws five scoring passes. The eventual 60-7 final score leaves Apple Valley a touchdown shy of equaling the 67-7 barrel game score of a year ago. Chad Smith also scores three touchdowns for the Sun Devils, one this 83-yard scoring play in the first quarter that stakes Apple Valley to an early 14-0 lead. This scoring strike to Kashan Griffin in the third quarter Center R.J. Hayes, snap. Jeff Widener, throw. Kishan Griffin, catch on the quick out pattern. Seth Baker, 29, leads Sun Devils tacklers. Seth Baker is all over the place this night defensively, tying the Sun Devils record for tackles in one game with 22. Kishan Griffin runs two kickoffs back for touchdowns and adds a pass interception for a touchdown. His three TDs lead top-ranked Apple Valley to a 53-30 victory over Barstow. Jeff Widener, the completion to Chad Smith, an 85-yard scoring play, setting a new school record for longest pass play for a touchdown. Chad Smith had broken the previous record the week before with an 83-yard scoring play. Kishan Griffin is a legitimate scoring threat every time he gets his hands on the football. This kickoff return, 80 yards for Kishan Griffin's third touchdown of the night. It is also his third kick return for a touchdown on the year. He ran a punt back 60 yards one week earlier against Granite. Add three pass receptions for touchdowns to his repertoire, and you get the picture. To hold down the Sun Devils, you must stop Kishan Griffin. Apple Valley Sun Devils scored twice in 16 seconds in the third quarter in route to a 57-12 bell game victory over Victor Valley. Kishan Griffin's kickoff return for a touchdown, followed by Seth Baker's interception and 75-yard return putting the game well out of reach in the 49th edition of the Battle for the Bell. The eventual 57-12 win is Apple Valley's seventh consecutive Bell game victory. Apple Valley wins the Desert Sky League a second year running. Anyway, that's the way the Sun Devils see it as they run the table against DSL teams a second straight season, polishing off the pre-Mojave River League slate with a 77 to nothing thumping of Adelanto. Eight different Sun Devils score touchdowns, and the team's total dominance of the Saints is exemplified by this second quarter safety led by 42 senior inside linebacker Jacob C. Jeff Widener throws three TD passes, including this game winner to Xander Witt in the fourth quarter. And Apple Valley holds off Oak Hills 31-24 in a crucial Mojave River League duel. Jeff Widener hits Kashan Griffin on scoring passes of 25 yards, then 21 yards in the first quarter. And then the junior quarterback scores on a 28-yard run in the second quarter as the Sun Devils jump out to a 21-0 lead against the visiting Bulldogs. The Sun Devils' O-line grinds out a drive that consumes the final nine minutes of the ball game to ensure the victory. Did Burroughs get burned by Friday the 13th bad luck in this 14-7 loss at Apple Valley for the Mojave River League lead? Donovan Ferguson breaks loose for 50 yards, the longest play of the night, and carries to the three-yard line, setting up the Sun Devils' go-ahead touchdown. I just 
follow my pulls and I saw the linebacker start to flow, so I just cut up field and put my head down and got the first down. The senior running back scores two plays later in what proves to be the final touchdown scored in the defensive battle between the two highest ranked teams in CIF among Mojave River League and Desert Sky League school. Third and long, ball on the 20. Jeff Widener with a pass as perfectly thrown as you could ever hope for. Kashan Griffin with the catch, both knees inbounds as he slides out of the end zone. Touchdown, Sun Devils. Uh, it, was, it was a perfect, perfect ball by Jeff. I just went up and, go, and went and go get it. That was it. Isaac Miles nails the extra point. 14-7 will be the final score. Big playmakers from Apple Valley's milestone triumph over Serrano. The Apple Valley Sun Devils beat Serrano 28-7 to virtually clinch the first Mojave River League football title in school history. Jeff Widener scores on a 24-yard first quarter run and throws a scoring pass on the last play of the first half. And Donovan Ferguson scores two touchdowns on runs of 1 and 18 yards to run Apple Valley's winning streak to 8 games and get the better of the Diamondbacks in the battle between the only unbeaten teams in the MRL. Apple Valley's defense twice denying the home team Diamondbacks on fourth and short in the red zone in the first half and once more in the third quarter. Uh, basically we, we know that they changed from their spread formation to a power set so we just had to come down hill and just kill someone. So. We just had to compete, get this W. Um, we came in with a strong mind, knowing that we were going to play hard, come down on defense, and that's about it. Apple Valley clinches their first Mojave River League football title in school history and first gridiron championship since the 1985 San Andreas League crown with a 43-13 victory at Sultana. Five different Sun Devils score, led by leading ground gainer Donovan Ferguson's two touchdowns, the second coming as sprinklers were going on. Jeff Widener throws a 33-yard scoring pass to Xander Wick and scores on a 50-yard run. Donovan Williams' eight-yard touchdown put the Sun Devils ahead to stay. The victory is Apple Valley's ninth without a loss. The 2017 Apple Valley Sun Devils have officially entered the hallowed archives of gridiron milestones, becoming the first undefeated team in school history. The 42-7 victory over Hesperia gives the Sun Devils their first Mojave River League football championship in the process, their first league crown in 32 years. Jeff Widener and Kashan Griffin collaborate on three touchdown passes, scoring plays of four, seven, and 30 yards. Kashan Griffin finishes regular season play with nine TD receptions and 15 touchdowns overall, the team's leading scorer. For Jeff Widener, four scoring passes on the night, including this toss to the wide open Chad Smith and what turns into a 64-yard touchdown. Coach Matt Rohrbaugh's Sun Devils enter the postseason the number one team in CIF Division 10 rankings, adding to their landmark season. This is the first Apple Valley team ever ranked number one in their CIF Division. Apple Valley scores early, often, and practically every way possible in routing 29 palms 75 to nothing in first round CIF playoff action. Xander Witt runs the opening kickoff back for a touchdown. Donovan Ferguson scores from 41 yards out on the Sun Devils' first play from scrimmage. Jeff Widener hits Kashan Griffin with an 11-yard scoring pass to cap Apple Valley's second possession. Linebacker Jesse Griggs picks off a Wildcats screen pass and runs it in for a touchdown. Another touchdown by the defense, Jeremy Justice strips the ball. Defensive end Angelo Tuzolino scoops it up and scores from 20 yards out. All of this scoring in the Sun Devils 54 points first half outburst. The Sun Devils first and only loss comes in game 13, the CIF semifinals 21-14 decision to eventual CIF champions Quartz Hill. Donovan Ferguson blasts through the hole and carries for 20 of his 97 yards on the night. 
to the 20. Next play, Donovan Ferguson breaks through a pair of tacklers, bounces off another, and skips into the end zone. Fifth touchdown in the playoffs for Donovan Ferguson. It is 7-7 with 7-15 showing on the second quarter clock. Clutch play in the biggest way. Fourth and six. Jeff Widener's toss to Donovan Ferguson is caught and the Sun Devils are on the verge of tying the score on the 32-yard play. Isaac Miles, 53 of 56 on the year. 14-14 with just under six minutes showing on the Newton T. Bass Stadium scoreboard. The Sun Devils' magical season ends with their only loss of the year. Matt Rohrbaugh's 2017 team roared to unprecedented heights, broke the record for wins in a season, raised the bar for future teams, and provided memories that shall last a lifetime. The best of 2017 High Desert Sports Highlights. Presented by Volu Quality Truck Bodies. Family owned and operated since 1954. Volu manufactures state-of-the-art truck bodies for the construction industry nationwide. Volu Quality Truck Bodies. Supporting teams, schools, and athletes throughout the Victor Valley.